Hi, I'm Dr. Angela McBrady of drflute.com. Today's flute tip is building your technique by working on Moise scales. Uh, if you have the Moise book, Daily Exercises, it looks sort of like your Tafanel and Gobert in that it's a short and wide book. There are some really good exercises in there. I, I didn't discover this book till later in my college life. I think it's because someone left it in a practice room and I'm like, wow, let me look at this over a little bit. Uh, and I found various ways that this book is really excellent. It goes through all your scales in regular scales and then scales in seconds, scales in thirds, fourths, fifths, sixths, sevenths, and octaves. And when I started doing the scales other than, I mean, we all kind of know our scales in thirds, right? And, you know, we can go through all of those. I have my students play those, especially in the younger grades. But I have rarely done, with up to that point, my scales in fourths or fifths or sixths, sevenths, and they were considerably trickier. It took a while, and I also learned that I had a lot of glitches when I did my scales in fourths uh, because it's not a pattern that my fingers had grown used to. So take a look at ta uh, Moise's daily exercises and look at those different scales. Work on them for speed, work on them to have smooth fingers and you're going to find that it's going to help you in sight reading and playing any of your technical exercises because it's going through so many different patterns of scales that are used in your solos. Try it, you're going to like working on your scales in daily exercises. That's today's flute tip. If you like today's flute tip, Press the like button, subscribe, share it with your friends, and please comment below.